Exactly. Hello there. Slow going? Look, I don't mean to be rude, but this isn't as easy as it looks. So I'd appreciate it if you did not distract me. Sorry. Thank you. I do not suppose you could speed things up. If you're in such a hurry, you can lower a rope or a tree branch and find something useful to do. I could do that. I have some rope waiting up here. But I do not think that you would accept my help since I'm only waiting around to kill you. It does put a damper on our relationship. But I promise I will not kill you until you reach the top. It's very comforting, but I'm afraid you'll just have to wait. I hate waiting. I could give you my word as a Spaniard. No good. I've known too many Spaniards. So there's no way you'll trust me. Nothing comes to mind. I swear on the soul of my father, Domingo Montoya, that you will reach the top alive. Give me your hand. Thank you. We'll wait until you're ready. Again, thank you. I do not mean to pry, but you don't by any chance have six fingers on your right hand. You always began conversations this way. My father was slaughtered by a six-fingered man. He was a great sword maker, my father. The six-fingered man appeared and requested a special sword. My father took the job. He slaved a year before he was done. I've never seen its equal. The six-fingered man returned and demanded it, but at one-tenth his promised price. When my father refused, the six-fingered man slashed him through the heart. I loved my father, so naturally I challenged his murderer to a duel. I failed. The six-fingered man left me alive, but he gave me these. How old were you? I was 11 years old. When I was strong enough, I dedicated myself to the study of fencing. So the next time we meet, I will not fail. I will go up to the six-fingered man, and I will say, Hello, my name is Inigo Montoya. You killed my father. Prepare to die. You've done nothing but study swordplay. More pursuit than study lately. <clears throat> you see, I cannot find him. It's been 20 years now, and I'm beginning to lose confidence. It's work for Vizzini to pay the bills. It's not a lot of money in revenge. Well, I... I certainly hope you find him. You're ready, then. Whether I am or not, you've been more than fair. You seem a decent fellow. I hate to kill you. You seem a decent fellow. I hate to die. Begin. Naturally, though I find that Tybalt cancels Capofero. Don't you? Unless your enemy has studied his Agrippa.
I must know. Get used to disappointment. Okay. Kill me quickly. I would sooner destroy. Oh, fine.